Hello, hello, it's Jasmine Chanel bringing you another YouTube video around the world. This video is short and sweet. It's in Salzburg, Austria. A little background about my trip. This was part of my 49 days in Europe. So if you follow me on YouTube, you know that I went to Barcelona, Nuremberg, and then Madrid. In Nuremberg, I was thankful and blessed. It was a long trip, but in Nuremberg, I was with family. So that was really nice. I got to just kick it. I didn't have to look over my shoulder. Um, the day was planned for me. I didn't have to worry about a route. I literally just hung with family and they took care of everything completely different than Barcelona and Madrid where I was like completely alone. This was a day trip in Salzburg, Austria. So my trip to Salzburg was nothing but amazing. I said because I was with family I didn't have to worry about a lot we took the train in from Nuremberg to Salzburg which was about two hours I took my passport however there was never an official that like checked it but I would just recommend to bring it anyways just because you're leaving the country for my day trip I had a small backpack with a little bit of cash um, small hygiene products my GoPro and then my Nikon camera on my trip I ate a lot of ice cream I love ice cream visited the Salzburg Cathedral and visited Hellburn Castle which I'm going to be showing in this video. Salzburg, Austria is on the border of Germany. It's the birthplace of famous composer Mozart. He is known as to be one of the prolific and influential composers of that classical era and like back in the night or the 1750s if that name doesn't ring a bell you probably like heard his music is a roman catholic opened in 1928 in the old town of salzburg it wasn't the best that i've been on you know during my trip of europe but i would definitely recommend going because you know it just adds another one to the list you to Hellburn Castle. Um, this castle includes an audio tour guide so you'll watch me like going around with the phone in the video and there's a bunch of different languages um, so you can enjoy like inside and outside of the castle and the castle belonged to Marcus Sidicus who used this castle to entertainment for entertainment like the guides told us that he never even slept in the castle he just used it for parties and to entertain his guests. So as you can see, there's like multiple rooms and each room corresponds with a number on the remote. So you just like walk into a room, put the number into your remote tour, put it up to your ear, and then you are able to hear information. So he didn't, Sidicus didn't ever sleep in this castle because he had so many different cap castles, which is, can I have those problems? But if you're able to go outside the castle, there are some, I'll say, refreshing surprises. So I highly recommend it. Um, Salzburg to me was quite expensive, but I was just there for one day. So it was I would say Salzburg is expensive, but I was only there for a day, so it wasn't that bad. Now, if I was doing two weeks, mm, I would have to figure out a tight budget and find spots that were like compatible with the budget I was on, because eating in those like popular areas just wasn't how I was doing it for 49 days. But anyways, let's check check it out. I hope um, that if you don't only see this for entertainment, you're able to see what it would be like if you had a day in Austria. If you have any questions. 
on anything on this video, drop it below. Um, I had many other adventures during my summer trip to Europe. You can find it on my YouTube in Barcelona and Spain. Bunch of tips if you're female traveling alone, never done it before, you're thinking about it, considering it. You can see it here. You can check out my Instagram as well at Jasmine underscore Chanel with two ends. Um, that's all I got for now. Take care and see you on the next one. Thank you.